Hi everyone, welcome back. In this video, I am going to discuss about how to set access rights to different users. So according to your needs, you can set access rights for the users using your custom module. So let me go to the backend here for my custom module and in the py you can see this is my py page that is python page of my custom module that i have created a new custom model here company that employ so this is the custom model that i've created and now i'll be giving some access rights to the model here so for that you need to create a new directory called security and in the directory directory you need to specify a file csv file and you need to name it as io.model.access and here if you go you can see here you need to first give the id with the access as the suffix so you need to specify it as access and your model name or the id you can give your model name or you need to specify any id here you can give any name here and after that you need to specify your model name with dot so as i have given here the model name that is company dot employ and the next here you need to specify your model so I have given the model and the um, company the, uh, underscore uh, employee and you can leave this as blank or if you have any group user or if you have created any group user uh, you can specify the user here or if you don't have any user you can add it as base dot user that is the base dot group user and here you are giving the access rights where one is true and zero is false so here i've given all the access to the user that is the permission to read permission to write permission to create and permission to unlink so i've given all the permissions here so i'll just run this code and go to the front end and upgrade my custom module so once I upgrade my custom module, if you go to the custom module that I've created, you have all the access. As you can see here, you can create a record. If you want, you can delete a record. So you have all the access to the records here. And if you want to delete a record, you can easily delete it from here. And now let me go to the backend here and just give it as zero and zero so as you can see here the permission to write and permission to create is given as false so the user will not be able to write and create the record so after running the code you can come to the friend in here and upgrade your custom module so let me upgrade my custom module so after upgrading the custom module and if you go here to the custom module you can see the create sign is gone here and you cannot create a new record or write a new record because we have not given the access for that we are giving it as false so this is how you give the access rights for specific users for your custom module in Odoo 16. That's all for today. Thank you.